hello everyone welcome to windows tutorials in this video we are going to see that what steps you need to follow if your microsoft powerpoint is not working or if it is not responding now uh, if it is not responding that might be a uh, issue of ram so what you need to do is you can just try to close all the extra windows or the tabs if you're using any browser as well so just try to close them and wait for a few seconds and then see if it works for you if it doesn't then it might be an issue with the program itself so how are we going to solve the issue with the program it is what we are going to discuss in this video so the first step that you need to do is just go to the start uh, icon the search menu and type in powerpoint so microsoft powerpoint should come up like this now what you need to do is just go to this right panel and click on that option that says run as administrator so just click on this it would ask you for a user access control just say yes and then see if your powerpoint is working just try a few things maybe try to change your title uh, so like this i have changed the title and it is working fine for me so this is exactly what you need to try from your end once so once you have tried and it is working fine then it's well and good otherwise if it is not working for you then what you need to do is go on to the second step and that is to check for windows updates so what happens is sometimes uh, there are some pending windows updates that you have not uh, yet installed on your pc and that is the reason why some of the apps don't work because in the latest updates some of the support features some of the security features have been updated so in that case we need to make sure that all of our apps are working by making sure that our windows is updated as well so how do we check that for this right click on the start menu and go to settings so from the settings what you need to do is just go to update and security and the first option that comes is windows updates so as we can see in my case it is showing updates available so this is the update that is available in your case also if it shows some of the updates that are available what you need to do is simply just click on install now this would take around 10 to 15 minutes your updates would be installed your pc would be restarted so once your updates have been installed you can restart your pc and once it has restarted then just um, try to open the particular app in our case the powerpoint app and see if it is working fine if it is not then try to open it as an administrator now then it should work so uh, this is the second step that is you need to make sure that your windows is updated to the latest version that is available in your case and then you can just try to run the app if it doesn't work in this case also then what do you need to do so the third step is that you need to press the windows and the r key from your keyboard that would bring up the run menu now in this run menu you need to type appwiz.cpl this is all in small a double p app w i z wiz dot cpl and once you have typed it click on ok this would open up the control panel that allows you to change or uninstall a program now in your case what you can do is just press p on your keyboard and try to search for the microsoft powerpoint in my case it is not available uh, individually as a powerpoint because i have used the microsoft office professional plus 2010 package as a whole that gives me access to other programs like microsoft word microsoft excel as well so in my case this microsoft office professional plus 2010 is available in your case also if 2010 or 2007 2016 or any of the versions is available of the microsoft office package then what you need to do is just go on that package if only microsoft powerpoint presentation is available go there right click and click on change now this would op uh, ask you for a permission just say yes then microsoft office would open and here what you need to do is just click on repair now what happens is microsoft office will itself try to repair the product as a whole and once the repairing has been done you need to restart your pc again and then try to run the app this should work fine if it is not working fine then that means your product is buggy what do you need to do in this case is just uninstall the product so right now i'm just cancelling the setup for repairing and now what do you need to do uninstall what steps you need to follow for uninstall actually just follow the same step press windows r from your keyboard just bring up this run menu and type in appwiz.cpl click on ok then go to this microsoft office professional plus 2010 right click and click on uninstall so this will start uninstalling the program once it has been uninstalled then just refresh your pc two to three times and reinstall maybe with a different version 
or uh, maybe try to reinstall it with a different setup and once it has been reinstalled then your app should be working fine so that's how you fix the microsoft powerpoint if it is not working properly in your windows 10 pc that's it for this video thanks for watching